In this video, we'll be looking at 3D visualization of the PCB. Each footprint on the layout can have a 3D model associated with it. With any footprint in Proteus, you can normally download a step file from the internet, place it in the MCAD directory of your installation, and then simply load it and position it in the 3D model's dialog form. For existing designs, you can use the Update 3D Models option from the library menu to apply your step and IG's models to them. You can at any time launch the 3D visualization engine to generate a physical preview of the board. Go up to the toolbar and click the 3D visualizer icon. Proteus will then start to generate a 3D view of your circuit board. Several preset camera angles are available via the buttons at the bottom of the viewer to allow you to quickly rotate and flip the board. The zoom level can also be adjusted using the magnifying glasses or rolling the mouse wheel in and out. Clicking on the button at the bottom left will allow you to fly a camera around the board in order to get a view of a particular part of the board. When used in conjunction with the scroll wheel, you can zoom in on any particular component or area of the board that is of interest. Holding down the left mouse button and moving the mouse will allow you to view the board from any angle. You can set a transparent box around the board by clicking on the button at the bottom toolbar. This represents a container for the PCB and allows you to check for clearances. In this example, it can be seen that several components protrude from the current size constraints of the casing. The last icon at the bottom allows you to remove the components giving an unobstructed view of the bare board. Additionally, there are settings across the top to allow you to change the dimensions of the transparent case as well as other settings that would be important when laying out your PCB. If you want to export the 3D board for import into MCAD tools like SOLIDWORKS or Autodesk, you can do so via the Export MCAD options on the Output menu in Ares.